I'll tell you what, CNN should be ashamed of itself having you working for them. You are a rude, terrible person. You shouldn't be working for CNN. Today I'm going to talk about a very entertaining subject, Trump versus the media. And this is something that's been going on for four years now. Uh, their aggression toward Trump is ceaseless, it is fanatical, it is uncritical. These are the same people who say to me, Dinesh, you're such a, you know, you're so predictable. Everything Trump says and does has to be right. But whether that's true or not, they're the opposite. Everything Trump says or does has to be wrong, no matter what it is. What makes this even more strange is that these are the same, same people who sycophantically sucked up to Trump in his previous life. They love Trump. They made him into a celebrity. They made him into a kind of a hero. People aspired to be Trump, even rappers. And this was partly the media's doing. So how can it be that the same people who loved Trump once now suddenly hate him? He's quite manifestly the same guy. But here's the key difference. He is now a Republican. And I wanna highlight that a lot of the antagonism toward Trump comes from that. Now, it is tempting to believe, and some of us do believe, that somehow the media is different now than they used to be. They used to be so nice to Nixon and Reagan and George H.W. Bush. No, no, I was there. There was tremendous hostility, even to Reagan. Uh, Sam Donaldson of ABC News had famous clashes with Reagan and um, Donaldson sort of remembers those days this way. And his relationship with the press, he didn't like the things that were said against him that he thought were unfair, that were wrong, when people said <laughs> terrible things about him in the press. But he understood our role, and I never saw him bridle at a reporter. I never saw him belittle a reporter. I never saw him attempt in public, I wasn't with him in private, to complain about press treatment. He knew what we were about and what we were doing. And I but the thing to note is the hostility was there. What Sam is really saying is that Reagan had a way to go over the heads of the media. I think this is the key difference. Not that the media was any friendlier toward Reagan, but he didn't take them on directly. Reagan was above the fray, Trump is in the fray. And the key point is that he attacks back. He makes them look ridiculous. Look at these briefings. I mean, they remind me of the old John Wayne movies where he walks into a bar and there's a bunch of yahoos there yelling and screaming and he pistol whips a few of them and then kind of walks out of the room and there's dead silence when he leaves as a new sheriff in town. And that's Trump's attitude. I'm the grown up in the room. You've got this overgrown fetus, Acosta. You've got all these other yahoos. Um, and I'm going to treat them like the yahoos they are. I'm going to meet their aggression with aggression. If they kick me in the shins, I'm going to kick them back. I think ultimately it is Trump's lack of respect for these people who deserve no respect. That is what gets them more than anything of all.